Okay, guys, so anyway, I gotta move some of this stuff. Um, so yeah, we did a bunch of um, FT8 on six meters today. And um, I don't know why this thing keeps doing this. Like, uh, display options, hide faint monitors, hide monitors. I don't, I don't want the monitors on here. Okay, so if we look at the last 12 hours, we will be able to see that all of these, uh, about five or six hours ago, um, were on six meters. I don't know what these L's stand for, but... We got as far as Ohio for picking up propagation. So Ohio would be 1,584 miles from my location. Now let's take a look at uh, Mississippi. Um, 1,377 miles. That's pretty good too. And then uh, let's see here. We got... Um, Wyoming's not that far, actually, 795 miles. I'd love to move there. Uh, Iowa. Iowa, 1,043. Um, Minnesota, 1,212. So, I think Ohio at 1,584 was the furthest... Received signal, yeah. So that was uh, KD8 Sierra India. And he was using WSJT6 6MX5 antenna, some kind of 6 meter antenna, so probably optimized station. But anyway, um, so let me get this stuff cleared out of here. I was going to show you guys something. So in here is my Zygu G90. Maybe not everybody knows I have one, but I do. Um, and I bought this, I believe, February 2020. Um, uh, like, basically, um, I bought it and uh, paid for it before I drove down the HRO. Um, or, oh, I drove down the HRO, knocked on the door, um, gave him my card, they took my card, they took the payment, and then uh, he came out the door and brought me my radio and told me a lot of people really like these things, and they do. It's a great radio. Mine's never been opened up. Mine's never been Mars modded. Mine's never been uh, abducted by aliens, um, and I have um, this plastic part on the bottom here. Um, I need to uh, do the rest of the, uh, there's a special set of legs that fit on here. Um, I don't know what I did with them, but this radio here is absolutely awesome. Um, I've used it portable quite a bit. The tuner is amazing. The audio is like that of a 7300. Lots of uh, unsolicited uh, compliments. So, yeah, they put a little sticker here. Um, so when I bought it, Ham Radio Outlet was selling them for $419 and I'm not sure what year this thing came out, but I think it was just out, uh, not too long. So oh, we were watching the guy's radio, uh, T-Rex arms or something. Anyways, uh, he was, uh, using one in like a man pack style thing and he somehow broke this and I'm not sure what kind of system he was using to do digital because this will be the headphone out and this will be like the maybe like a cat control or I don't think it's a microphone in is it anyway all I've ever used is the accessory plug on the back that goes to my signal link and um, you can also use other things on here but anyway I didn't really understand why uh, he was using those because they are, they're vulnerable. They stick out. Yes. Um, anyway, I left a comment on his video and you know, he makes very 
nice professional videos. So you probably have nothing special to say to me because here I am, Mr. ADD, ADHD, ham radio hack guy. <laughs> but uh, anyway, we left a comment for him about how you can actually just take the microphone, put the microphone right next to the laptop speaker, let the laptop decode everything. So anyway. Uh, just showing you guys the G90 that I got. 